Hey, it's Brian here from QuantLabs.net. Just wanted to show you uh, the new MATLAB 2014A here. I'm going to show you uh, something that you can expect to see from QuantLabs.net, uh, both for my members and for my uh, maybe some free uh, giveaways I might give away. Giveaways, giveaway, well, whatever. Um, so I'm in my MATLAB. I'm going to show you a script I just uh, wrote. Now, this little script called testbuildne.m is very basic. It's, it's a, an M script that just displays a number of messages. Hello, I am fine, thank you. Your pal, Brian. Ooh, okay. So, I'm going to test this build, builder any toolbox. And basically what it's going to do, it's going to deploy, or I'm going to build a, a Windows application exe file. It's all self-contained show how it works. So if we have the deploy tool, um, I have if you just type that I'll bring up the builder any and um, there's a number of options you'll get. Here I'm just showcasing the uh, application development. So you know you can add in a splash page, some required files and so on and so forth. Also this is the actual process it'll go through, it'll build it. Uh, build a package and then make it available in the folder. This is what it contains. So um, upon success, successful build, you get some resources if you want to include those. Uh, if you want to include the splash page, which I just showed you is basically my logo of the company and the actual exe file, which is this is application. Now it comes with a readme as well. Um, but uh, I'll include these as, as a sampling of what um, you can expect. So, as I said here, let me just step back here. Um, when you come into the deploy tool, uh, you're just downloading a, a standalone application, adding this file. On top of that, you have these, uh, as I said, these um, extra files that you may not really need. Um, this installer for web um, and then some additional settings. I don't think you really need to worry about that. And of course the package itself, which will bring up that GUI I just showed you and I'll walk you through or I'll walk through the process as it builds. So let me run the uh, the actual uh, executable here. So uh, what I noticed is um, you need to run it from a system console. So just go to the proper uh, folder, obviously, in the in the command prompt here. All you're going to do is really just run this T, uh, exe file. Okay. So in this case, um, test build any. And what it's going to do is going to load in my little splash page, and it's going to display those display messages that I built here. Uh, These messages I just showed you. Um, these guys display messages, so they're displayed in the console, as you can see. And then it ends. That's it. Um, so I'll be building some demos of uh, and make them deployable and uh, be a self-contained EXE application for Windows users. It's definitely a powerful feature. Um, but I uh, just wanted to show that to you um, and it's probably the DLLs and all that stuff and the Java that you've seen before so hopefully you'll enjoy that little ditty and if you want to download the EXE and all the other files just go to my blog talk to you later